Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. was too low. All these new machines are touching you. Hello, sir. Just don't do anything crazy. Corvo, you're back! Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide-and-seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. All right then, let's go see Mother. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other isles? My nanny says the big ocean's full of them, but I think she only says it. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. Let's go! Come on! You saw my improvements to the waterlock. Should be. She'll see you at once. People, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early, full of surprises, as usual. Mother's going to be happy. Follow she me, misses It's you. a fair wind that brings you home to me. 
What news have you brought? I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. One more job shouldn't have mattered. I'd killed nobles before. You could float a whaling ship on the highborn blood I've spilled. Another noble steps in to replace the last one. All equally corrupt. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them Why away? Why should an empress be different? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! But she was. I watched her bodyguard's face as they took him away. Dead eyes. I knew I'd pay for this one. Maybe I deserve to. <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Emily, protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do, won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. <laughs>